Welcome to a brand new episode of Gran Turismo 7. I hope you guys are still watching this. I've recorded a lot of episodes and the first part is not even out yet. But I can't stop playing it. So hopefully you guys are coming along for the ride. Today, we're taking pictures. Yes, I haven't really touched on this too much yet. But basically, you can drop your car into environments and take pictures. And it looks it does look kind of crazy. Um, let's do my very first scape, I guess. We go here. Why, why not? I think I can actually change the vehicle. We can move it around at other vehicles. This is Italy. So let's change the vehicle. Have a, a, have a, a car in mind. There we go. <laughs> it fits perfectly. Absolutely perfect. I can change the steering angle on the, on the, on the tire at the front. There's so much I can do. Here you got a bunch of effects as well. So the temperature, ooh, zoom in, zoom out. Options, am I good? Yes, I'm done. Hope he likes my shot. So we've got Iceland, Morocco, Miami. What oh, is loads? What? That's random. Yeah, there's a lot of locations where you can just go bam, put your vehicle in, make it look sexy. Low angle, ground up, Monza. There's so many. There's so much to this game, honestly. There's so much content. Uh, I think we unlock a track for doing this. I know the picture was just absolutely incredible. Luca was so impressed. He loved it. Yay, Trail Mountain. Sweet. Oh boy. Ooh, who's this? Got a couple of newcomers. Who's Jeremy? What does he do? He's geeking out about racing, okay. We'll leave him to one side for now. Finish in the top three. And we unlock Fuji. Fuji as a track. Okay, a new championship has begun. Oh, I need a national A license. I believe I do have that. So we are good to go. To finish in the top three. Wonder what car we need. I'm hoping it doesn't involve any money because I, I need to start saving i want to start buying vehicles i just keep spending it on tuning upgrades let me shine let me let me Ooh. trail mountain is the whole event going to be at trail mountain i guess it is i just want to race i want to race my little heart out and get max points all right, menu book number 17. I wonder how many there are. Is it 20, 30? I'm gonna have it a guess and say 30. That's my guess. All right, do we have a specific car that will work for this championship? Um, it needs to be a United States. It needs to be a road car. And they recommend 600. I mean, the Mustang could be fine. Mustang could be pretty good. Or maybe we use the um, the Camaro ZL1. Yes, maybe that's what we go for. So it's Trail Mountain Circuit, and then obviously in reverse as well. So it's two rounds. We have the license we need. Should I use the Mustang? I feel like we used the Mustang a lot in the last episode. No, we'll stick with this. Something could be different. Haven't done any modifications to this car at all eek. Eek, eek, eek now that's going to involve some catching up of course let's go max points please look at the head start he's got he's going to finish the first sector before even, i've even started the going first starts we're quick though we are very quick oh this car is not messing about oh it feels good it's very good oh, i did this bit a lot 
for a license. It's one of the hardest ones I've done so far. I have a bit of experience. As far left to here as possible. Slam the brakes on. Get close to that wall. Early on the power. That's what the licenses do. They, they, you, you go, oh, I recognise this corner. I know how to do this corner. I know how to push on this corner. It's a nice feeling. Don't hit that wall. Nice and early on the power. This car is a monster. An absolute monster. I think it has to be, honestly. Put the glam first. It's disappeared. Nice, this corner coming up. I've really got a break early here. Plowing into that wall because that'd be really embarrassing. Ooh. And we're doing this in reverse as well. Come on! Up to third is not bad. Still got to find a lot of time here. What a beautiful track though. Always has been. Always has been. Come on Camaro, we're brothers. Get out of my way, you know I've got a better chance of winning this. You know what, dude? Oh. Don't break to me like that. Oh, I'm beautifully close to that wall. Beautifully. I've had the, um, the, the, so the headlights come on when you go under a bridge. Just neat little touches like that. I'm going to be just a Dodge Viper in the lead. And do I break? Might have used him briefly to break that. <laughs> just briefly. I will say thought we unlocked this track already. See, I was uh, severely wrong. What I'm going to do now is finish and we get max points. Just no big mistakes. Keep it chilled. Keep it chilled. Not too chilled. <laughs> like that. Very, very nice car to drive. Really good on the brakes. Really good at the corners with traction. Good at going over the curbs. Very nice car to drive. Tons more potential there in terms of time per lap. Probably maybe even a slightly OP car for this for this particular tournament. But there we go. Man's not gonna complain. And now we're doing that race again in reverse. It'll probably be slightly more trickier. But I, I feel fairly confident. Feel fairly confident. One by four seconds in the in the end. Twelve points in the bag. I think we had the strongest car there, honestly. Twenty thousand. Are we going to hit three hundred thousand? <gasps> wow. <laughs> what a blessing. That'd be incredible. Yeah, these replays. I need to watch more of these replays because they're just oh. So at the moment it should be thirty FPS, but it's got ray tracing, so you should see the reflections in the um, in the paintwork it looks so good it's good looking car anyway but when I overtake a car you should see the reflection of the Mustang for example in it and that was a bad example but 
Oh, it is stunning. It is stunning. Imagine seeing that thing chasing you. <laughs> You'd be petrified. On to the next one. Ideally, top two, and then just make sure we we concrete the victory. Of course, it's still further above, so we're, we're, in, we're in a good position right now. But we are going in reverse. <laughs> He's already finished the straight. Look! We're going first. What a joke. Let that engine roar. Let's go. Look, he's out of the chicane already. He gets such a head start. I realize I'm repeating myself, but it's true. A bit cautious now. Yeah, it feels, the weird, it feels weird in the, in the gaming world. It does go a little bit quiet after this game releases. Like the start of the year has been fairly um fairly crazy but it does yeah it does definitely go a bit quiet quite sure why that is but there's been so many good racing games as of late so we have Forza Horizon Grid Gran Turismo should have the new F1 game coming out at some point this year as well I reckon there's going to be another Codemasters game that's outside of F1 and Grid Sure, what? But yeah, I think this year is a very good year for gaming. Very good year for racing games, even. Hello, Tesla! Going so much quicker. And do I break? Oh my god. I was breaking for absolutely ages. Still wasn't enough. Wow, this is it feels weird coming from this angle. It feels weirder somehow. Not quite sure why. But this, this car just feels a lot more planted than the Mustang. Like I, I can get on the power. There's no real sort of issues there at all. It's starting to get very, very dark. Let's run now. Chase me if you can. Going first has a five and a half second lead. Which is quite a considerable amount of time. where we should make up a lot of time but be very careful on this corner look at how abrupt it is I just slammed the brakes on earlier than I would ever think to do so I don't quite know when actually uh, now yeah oh, I think I got that pretty spot on no my lights flashing? Is that me? Oh, I'm doing that. Pressing the left, um, the left stick in. <laughs> do not mean to do that. I guess you can like flash your uh, your multiplayer rival. Oi! You idiot! Your plonker. <laughs> when do you break the? Wow, it's so bright. Yay, first place! Goes to me! Good racing. 
Thank you, everybody. I appreciate you. First place. 24 points. Done. That's what we do. What do we unlock for doing this? Normally, we get something fairly cool for doing these, uh, these championships. Again, I wonder how many more championships there are to unlock as well. I don't know. Oh, we're so close to 30,000. First place. Oh, yeah. Let's forget that. Oh, there we go. Nice little bonus. Oh, yeah, of course we get a, a gift. Ooh. N nothing particularly overwhelming, but still. Uh, that is probably the least... Yeah. Do I already have that? I've already got the S30, you know, don't I? I'll have a look. Let me have a look. Oh, fantastic. I'm, sh I'm sure I've got this car. Saying that, I don't think I'd get, I'd get any collector's points if I already had the car. So maybe I don't. We have a new racing helmet. And a new car that I probably won't ever use. Yay! <laughs> that was, yeah, I did not want that vehicle at all. The 300 or the 180 SX, sure. I'll take it off your hands. I'll go back to the calf and see what he says. Is it Fuji, isn't it? That's an excellent result. I've received a message from an American who watched the race. He wants to pay a visit to this. What? Oh, yes. He's got a new shop. I was like, what What shop? It's called Legend Cars. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Come on. That is what I want. Legend Cars. So I believe the, the cars change fairly often. Oh, Nissan Sports Cars. Okay. I'm completely hooked on this. What is this? So, okay, so I have the Fair Lady already. I don't have the R32 and I don't have the Sylvia. All right. Start. Sure. Go for it. Why not? Yeah, these are incredible cars. I love Nissans. I'm such a little fanboy. I own the 350. I own the R35 now. I love Nissan with all my heart. I wish one of the cars was an R35, honestly, but there we go. Right. What cars are currently within this shop? It took quite a while to grind to this point to unlock these legendary cars. It's, the game wants you to grind. The game wants you to progress, which I'm, I'm all for. Uh, welcome to Legend Cars. This is a special dealership known for only... Oh, Legend Cars offer a limited number of highly sought-after collectible cars from the 20th century, along with a few iconic cars. Okay. I can't wait to see what they have to offer us, to offer us today. Let's find out. Oh. Okay, so the DB5 is sold out. The mileage is fairly limited. Okay. Okay, what, what, what do I go for, guys? Is there anything that tempts me? That is a true classic. The Subaru GT500 1997. I used to love that car in the old ones. So that's the only one I can currently afford. Um, the E-Type Coupe 61, which is a gorgeous looking car. That is currently sold out, so I just can't buy it. Which is kind of annoying. That's 1.5 million, so I can't afford that. But at least, at least they're there. At least, at least they're there, ready to be bought when um, when I have the currency, when I have the, the funds available. Yeah, I think we'll end this episode here. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Sorry, it was a slightly shorter one than usual. We are going to be working on these Nissans in the next episode. We've almost unlocked all the locations in Asia. Europe, we've still got a little way to go yet, actually. And America, we're over halfway. So we've, st we've still got a few things to unlock. We've, st we've still got a little way to go yet. And I can't wait. Oh, it's the Tokyo Expressway. Oh, no. What is it? What, what do I need? Japanese car. And it has to be a 550. We, I'm pretty sure we have that covered. Yeah. So I can use the Supra. I can use the 350. I can use the BRZ. Yeah. We should be fine. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys soon. And bye-bye.